they will secure that first. As well as Admiral Bulldog are pushing in this Dyer's bottom tier bottom one tower, tower but Cloud9 attack. opting probably more for farming at this point in time. I don't think they have the team fight abilities to contest, especially with that black hole being used in the mid lane. And Loda now has his blink dagger too, so it might be an easier way for Tier 2, Alliance bit by bit. They're letting Loda be out in the front. I love this. Loda's way out in the front, and then Admiral Bulldog a little bit farther back. So it, it, they like can't really go for Loda because he has that reincarnation at any point in time. At the same time, he's in a great position to be able to make a jump. So if a single support, or even just one or two, low, but in the meantime, Alliance are actually committing to the Tier 3 tower push here with Loda and the others, and of course they can relocate in at any point in time. Faces Void jumps out and is going to get a Chronosphere onto two here. Owie, not close enough to be able to get any hits, but it doesn't seem to matter. Bone 7 has more than enough damage. They get two, but Tier 3 tower is still in trouble. They're going to blink in, grab Sing Sing with the Orc in, and that's going to ensure his death, but can they continue to fight? Cloud9 Pumps out, locks down Loda even more. The rest of Cloud9 dancing around these heroes. Oh, S4, he's fighting up with Loda. Second life comes back. Loda starts focusing on Bone 7. They silence him up. S4 gets low, but not enough. And Alliance start moving out. Durian comes back in. They back comes right behind Cloud9. And if they win this, make this win this fight, they can go straight for the racks here. Loda fighting up against Bone 7. Bone 7 has a time walk, but he's being held in too long. He goes down. Howie looking for the black hole, but is it too late? He gets stopped too! C9, they're losing in this fight! Alliance, they're doing it! They're finally gonna be able to take down Cloud9, but the 5X are coming out! Eternal Envy, he's come back in, and he is a beast right now with that IS Scotty. Cloud9 with enough 5X will... Sounds, Loda, he's left! Sing Sing goes down without that damage. They can't do it. Alliance, they get the big damage dealer on Cloud9, and they do it all the way. 83 minutes in, and they take it in game two. Unbelievable performance of all. If anyone questioned whether or not Alliance is back, the answer is they're back. 100%, man. 100%. Hey, guys. Unbelievable way to end the night. But first, we have to jump to the analyst desk and get those guys' thoughts on what was an outstanding match on both sides.